possible that world leaders enact and enforce laws to address harmful practices and violence to women to ensure we can create a brighter future for everyone. Now, please welcome the UN Secretary General's Envoy on Youth, Jay Atma Wickramanayaka. Hello, global citizens. As the United Nations Envoy on Youth, my role is to advocate for our needs and rights as young people and make sure that young people are meaningfully included in the quest to achieve the global goals by 2030. Over the past year, I have had the privilege to speak with young people across the Commonwealth and beyond, and the message is clear. We must achieve a world free from poverty, violence, and discrimination. A world that provides equal opportunities for all and leaves no one behind. Achieving sustainable development will remain a dream rather than a reality if we are leaving 50% of our population behind. Today, in many places, legislation discriminates against girls and women when it comes to access to finance, minimum age of marriage, and equal pay. A law that discriminates against a woman is a law that discriminates against all of us. So, to all Commonwealth leaders present this evening, I firmly stand with the thousands of global citizens that have called on you to level the law and take concrete measures to end gender discrimination in the law by 2030. Thank you.